Success, success is a progressive realization of a worthwhile dream. Worthwhile dream. Bertie and I grew up in a small mill town upstate New York. I was a shy kid in school and I was a stutter. I always had a dream of having my own business. My mom told me when I was a little kid, the Jaeger means you can't work for somebody Jaegers else. Jaegers don't work for other people. You can't work for somebody else. He was a doer. He wanted to accomplish things. He had big dreams. Yeah, he knew my dad and I knew his dad, but we didn't know each other. <laughs> It was kind of a funny thing. Successful people are ordinary people with extraordinary desire to move in some direction. We're making $95 a week. $95 a week before taxes. At West End Brewery. And we were broke. I was sick and tired of being sick and tired. Sick and tired of being sick and tired. Our dreams were this big. And I was sick and tired of somebody else owning me. I prayed for six months that God would give me my own business. I believed all my life I was going to succeed and I should succeed. And I believed that hard work was the answer. But I didn't realize until later in life that it took a vehicle to put that hard work behind. I didn't understand that this opportunity would change the course of our lives. We didn't take any investment. It was only $8 to get in. It was our ticket to freedom. Everybody tried to tell us how dumb we were, how immature we were. They called it crazy and we were nuts to be in the business. I was just an average guy. But I had more than the average willingness to pay the price. I had more than the average hunger. I used to think that if everything went good, then I'd decide what to do. <laughs> then I had to learn that you decide first, and then everything falls in place, you know? They struggled the first couple of years, and uh, they started putting the pieces together and figuring out what was working and what wasn't working. He was the most motivated, person I think I'd ever been around in my life. We thought he was nuts. Many, many new people come and they expected him to be, you know, as polished, handsome, tall. As big as he is and as well as they're doing, you know, this guy's got to be like 6'10". Well, that's, that's not the case. I'm just a small guy, but the world starts with me and my dream and my energy and my ambition. He had a determination and a drive you don't see and just the average person. There's people that talk better than I do. There's people that have more education than I do. They provide a vision for what the whole team working together could do. Your group is your family. It comes from the heart. It comes from the heart of both of them. She was such a mentor and a leader to all the women that you just immediately connected with her. We believe the best thing we can do is to help people stand on their own two feet. They had a true uh, love and caring for people. Personhood leadership goes beyond what that person has physically touched. Empowering other people to um, use their talents and gifts and skills to do what they want to do in life. Uh, the way I was brought up, I was constantly had a lot of dexterisms whispered into my ear. They have a whole vocabulary of success. Persistence. Perseverance. Of, stamina. Never giving up. Never give up. Not letting obstacles stop you. Speaking yeah. great things Not letting existence. anybody steal my dream. Do you believe? He would whisper, do you believe? They, they become part of your, your mindset. All the things that are just lasting principles that you know, no matter where you apply them in life, they're going to work. So of course, we learned everything we know from Dexter. And when I say Dexter, of course, I mean Bertie too. They could see his passion for people and that, they, that he wanted for them what he had. I mean, this is the largest gathering of future millionaires you'll ever see. Round the rack, Dexter and Bertie Yeager. Because of you, we have had to create an award for 45 points, then 50 points, and now 55 points. People need people. People. We see the Amway sales plan in this day and how it looks for the future. The Amway sales plan has made dreams come true. A dream come true that I didn't know that I would ever have. Coming from where we came from, there was no way to see anywhere close to this. You know, I look at my parents as being leaders among leaders. The biggest star ever, ever in this business is Mr. Dexter Yeager. Today is the first day of the rest of your life. The opportunity comes to each one of us. The information is timeless, and the stories are timeless. But it's our choice what decisions we make about each of those opportunities. Don't, don't ever give up on anybody. anybody. And for, for God's, God's sake, sake, don't, don't give up, up on, you. on you. And that's all that we need, somebody that provides that example of leadership, what's possible, and that it's worth it. I could never dream that I'd be where I am today. Everybody needs a dream. A man without vision. I've always wanted to the ultimate message should be 
You can do it. Desire, desire to move in some direction. direction. direction.